Yo, hello, brain dead. <laughs> <laughs> is the I love you to me or is it to brain dead? Both. Aww. How sweet of you, cat man. Your avatar is really cute. Holy shit. <laughs> Thank you. I worked really hard on making the design. <laughs> It'll be really fun to eventually make it into a VTuber, but for now we just have a gift tuber. What's the process for making a VTuber avatar? Okay, um, so that will kind of vary on if you want to do a 3D model or a live 2D model. So, the route I want to do is live 2D, which is probably arguably <laughs> the harder route. Because while you do just take an image, you do have to splice, like, every single thing that you want to move on its own. Including, like, the eyes gonna be, like, multiple parts. So that way when you rig it, you can have everything moving as you need it to. So after you create the file, that's going to be a bajillion layers <laughs> for everything. You can then go into Live 2D, which is a program, and then you rig it so you can make it so the things can move as you need it to. And then you'll need another program, which will track your face and connect all those like rigging that you did to make it work and just using a 3d model is pretty much the same thing except for you work on a 3d model and 3d models are a lot easier to build because there's a lot more like free materials for you to like start off on but i like to make things hard and go the live 2d route but also it means i get to make everything myself so eh. I also do prefer the look of live 2D over 3D models. But it's certainly a process, overall. <laughs> yeah, it is it is pretty in-depth. I've been meaning to like get around to it for the longest time, but first I had to pick a design that I was actually super satisfied with, which is why we have this lovely gift tuber that's not even a full body image. It's literally just what you see, just the shoulders up. But yeah. It'll be a process until we upgrade from this gift tuber to a VTuber. But I am pretty happy with where we're at for now. Went from a little sea bunny to an actual character, you know? <laughs> Progress, yeah. I'm glad all of you get to be part of the process of me going from a little C bun bun to an actual VTuber. Also, Catman, get food if you want food. Come on now. I'm lazy. Then order in food and <laughs> put in the, like, special, um, what's it called? Special directions to have them deliver it to you directly. That's how it works, right? Doors open, bring it to my room. <laughs> Third door on the left. Why not just get a PC? Because I like my Mac. My Mac has only 8 gigabytes. Why did you get an 8 gig model? Because I didn't know I was going to start streaming. I bought it a year ago. I thought I was still going to be at Big 5. It was before I was promoted to a manager, man. <laughs> That's half as much as RAM as my potato. Okay, good for your potato. <laughs> Mmm, potato. Go eat a potato, Catman. You're always complaining about needing to eat food on my streams, I swear. I love potatoes. Then eat some. But they're so far away. Well, I can't solve all your problems for you, Catman. Seven viewers at once. That's gotta be some kind of record. Honestly? I don't think it is because... One of my earlier Jackbox streams did get a lot of viewers. I don't remember was the max for that. But 7 viewers is pretty good though. Thank everyone that is here. I appreciate you. I guess I could make food. <laughs> I see the fire next to it doesn't count. Razor. I forgot I have a pie on my desk. Why do you have a pie on your desk? And how did you forget about it? 
It's wrapped in paper, so it blended in with my napkins. Why do you have napkins on your desk from all the fast food? Goodness. Don't you have, like, a trash bin by your desk so you can, you know, throw things away? <laughs> Does that make a little too much sense? I knew that was the next question. <laughs> you were prepared. <laughs> I did, but it's in the bathroom at the moment. Why is your room trash can in the bathroom? <laughs> Do you not have a separate bathroom trash bin? And I got a pie from It's Just Wings. Oh yeah, I forgot that they have pie. I don't- I think we've tried it before, but it's just been so long I really don't know that. Confidently words. I shaved my head though and just threw it- the bathroom because I was too lazy to throw it outside. <laughs> I see. Need a drink now? What kind of drink are you talking about? I got sodas in my mini fridge, but I should really get water. You really should get water, but if you don't have easy access water, like, soda is like fine enough, I guess. It's still better than nothing, you know? Unless it's alcohol, like Alan suggested. If I got a mini fridge, I would never leave my room. Hydration! <laughs> I do actually have a liquid death, so I guess I'm doing a little better than... ...y'all. Or I guess just Catman. I don't know if the rest of you have water. No, it's like a whole little family reunion in my Twitch chat. How cute. I didn't want to talk to you, I wanted the berries. You do have a gift for me, so I guess it's acceptable. The only water I drink has caffeine in it. It really is a family reunion in my Twitch chat today. <laughs> well, do you have my babies, Catman? Why are you like this? <laughs> only if you pay for the wedding. <laughs> Sonic the Stone Digimon? Stop. No. <laughs> poor Noel? Why do you say poor Noel? Is it because of her weapon? Is that why you said poor Noel? Because of her level 1 3 star weapon? Is that why? <laughs> if that's why, that's valid. <laughs> I'm hoping to fix that today. I want to craft the claymore for her. Water is so flat to me because of how much of a caffeine addiction I have. Maybe get carbonated water if it's flat to you. Don't you bra in my chat. I mean, water has no bubbles, that's what I'm getting at. Literally, sparkling water is carbonated. Oh, sweetie. Back with my plain old normal unflavored water. <laughs> club soda. Yeah, club soda is a thing. I don't think I've ever made anyone with a legit nickname. Wait, no, I take that back. There was one guy named Ball. I... That's an interesting nickname. It's even more interesting once you read the comic correctly. Oh. One ball, okay. In my defense, I am trying to play a game. That is kind of one of the main purposes of the stream. <laughs> oh, and I guess my cousin was called Butterball for a while. That's nice. Is it? Um, depends. Was the sarcasm clear? I had many nicknames growing up, but they weren't official. What does it mean to have an official nickname? <laughs> I don't think nicknames are typically official. I'd say when people you don't know call you by it. I see. They're mostly just mean, not just by your family. Helps if I do this right. Get them distracted by chat. Like, you know, they know your nickname, but not your actual name. Wouldn't that qualify strangers yelling slurs at you on the street as a nickname? I mean, if it happens often enough that you get called the same exact slur, maybe there's a chance it could qualify. I mean, multiple people would need to call you the slur, I suppose. Yeah. Fun fact, in the Souls game, there'd be a non-zero chance that one of these chests would try to eat you. Don't give miHoYo ideas. But for reals, have any of you like met a group of friends of a friend and they introduce one of them like, and this is Sleazy Pete? His name isn't even Pete. 
It's like Frank or some crap. Bold of you to assume that I have many friends outside of everyone that is currently watching this stream. Are those just normal dudes you're fighting? They are treasure hoarders. So yes, but no. They're like treasure hunters. Same difference. Hello, little birds. Ostensibly normal dudes, otherwise. Yeah. Little birds are cute. Mm, birds. Yes. Like, they don't have superpowers, but neither do a lot of the Hillitrolls, now that I think about it. True. Though, to be fair, if a treasure hoarder had a vision, they wouldn't be a treasure hoarder. Uh. Okay, I see this game as waifu. Rather the wild. So to see you fighting humans is a weird change of pace compared to the... I cannot process that. <laughs> Please behave yourselves, children. <laughs> For the love of anything. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Children behave. <laughs> You're in a public space. You're not at home. <laughs> Stop. Please. <laughs> Children. <laughs> Please. Every time I look away for a moment, it keeps getting worse. <laughs> well, that is wonderful for you, Spooky, that you're at home. I meant that the chat is a public space. <laughs> I'm at home, but it's not my home. <laughs> Stop raiding other people's homes, Sprain Dad. <laughs> it's his fault, Dad. You did not have to keep it going, Nigiri. <laughs> it's kind of like taking part- nope. And getting all fussy when the teacher tells all y'all sh to shush. <laughs> Like, I appreciate the chat engagement, you guys, but please, <laughs> control yourselves. That boar really wanted to kill you for five seconds. You know, it's not the only boar that to have attempted that. In at least one of my highlight videos, Xiao specifically got hit by a boar, so like... Why is that one in the water? Where are you going? <laughs> Where are you going, bro? <laughs> the fuck? You're literally also an archer. You didn't have to do that. Special. I look away for two seconds and you guys act worse. I shouldn't be surprised. Monty quit talking about Shmeet for God's sake. Stop encouraging him to talk about Shmeet, Nigiri. <laughs> Lead by example. I have moved to the gamer throne for mobile to continue watching. Wonderful. Thank you, Braindead, for your immense dedication. No, I don't want to fight whatever you are. I'm just out here vibing, man. Boar, please. No, why are you over here? Leave me alone. <laughs> Piss mages are so persistent, I swear to god. No. You're gonna get out of your range soon enough, you stupid mage. <laughs> Piss mages are almost as bad as Mormons. <laughs> I'm not going to refer to Mormons as the Piss mages. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> That's probably more true than any Mormon would like to believe. Honestly... Honestly, I've known Mormons to cast fireballs quite frequently. <laughs> Please. <laughs> I mean, more like the baptisms and weddings of the dead stuff, but yeah. What? <laughs> no, wait. I just remember this one time a missionary did a fireball. What? I... 
day. <laughs> like, not actually, but they were visiting our place for dinner this one time and giving a speech thingy about faith. Okay. Their example was a little dryer sheet cylinder thingy, and they offered to put it in my and or Gray's hand and light a flame with a lighter. I see. I know Mormons are questionable people, but offering to light something on fire in the hands of a child is, you know, not not great. We both said nah, but our dad said yes, and he lit it and when the fire put through the cylinder it shot a little ash ring into the air. I see. I'm glad the children had the sensibility to say no to that suggestion. Provided that they're children. It was actually sick as fuck, to be honest. But yeah, Mormon missionaries cast fireballs sometimes. <laughs> ah, boy. Well, how about that? Indeed. Definitely can't say I expected chat to end up going this direction of all directions. But it has. Brain dead is in chat and I made a Mormon joke. Really, it's just inevitable. I mean, yes. But also, like... Come on, you got a point. I mean, yeah. I feel like it's in the tree. Sounds like it's in the tree, and it looks like it's in the tree. Okay, man, I gotta know. Why is a character named Amber speaking Japanese in the game where all the place names are Mandarin? Okay, um, so Miss Amber is actually from Mondstadt, which is over here, which is the more English speaking based country but everything here in leeway is china based and she's speaking japanese because i picked that voiceover in my settings okay so two out of three lore one out of three weeb gotcha i mean yeah nuking my family's internet by watching your stream at the highest settings and downloading a massive patch for cyberpunk all at the same time <laughs> Amazing. I appreciate your dedication to the stream and to the game that you want to download. You play this game for the lore, the missions, or the collectibles? Um... Yes? I'll go with yes. Uh, so end goal is 100%ing it. I mean... Yeah. To an extent. Master Jing kinda got a dumpy. I... <laughs> Why are you like this? <laughs> I cannot possibly exaggerate how often I ask him that at work. I'm not surprised. Now let's do this all YOLO, YOLO to end the night. Fun. Okay. Well, yeah, it was a lot of fun. Bye-bye for now.